As which is sadly you lost your parents, Usakula, uh, yeah. pastor's kid, Ganjalo. Yes. about your experience. Was it any different? Um, to be honest, it's not easy being a preacher's kid. Yeah. Um, being born into it, you're born into a faith that you don't have a choice. Um, I mean, you're born into it, you must do it. My dad was very strict. Uh, as long as you're under his roof, it's his rules. And so that was how life was. But what the community does is that they place us on pedestals that we couldn't possibly live up to. Mm -hmm. And that's where the challenge comes in because my individuality is now based on whatever my parents did, mm -hmm. whoever they are. Mm -hmm. And if you step outside of the borders, or if you do something that's not right, the clapback is you're disgracing your parents. You're mm -hmm. disgracing the image of the church. Nobody cares about how you feel. Mm -hmm. Nobody cares about what you're going through. And remember, um, every time you force someone to do something, the mm. natural reaction is to do the exact opposite. Mm. If you tell me to drink water, all of a sudden I don't want to drink it. You tell me I can't drink water, all of a sudden I'm thirsty. Mm. That's how naturally humans react. And that's why people say rules are made to be broken. Because the more you tell me what to do, the more I don't want to do it. And so you're born into a church space filled with so many rules. And what do you want to do? The opposite. That's why a majority of us are labeled and termed as rebellious. Mm. Because we are trying to explore mm. and to find who am I as Abigail? Who am I as an individual? What do I actually like? We are in Kaza because Uleta <laughs> Ikama Eliti a rebel. But is this a case of being a rebel or just being a child and growing up? Hmm, that's, mm. that's a very good question because if we look at the definition of being rebellious is to stray from the crowd. You know, it's to do something that everyone else is not doing. Mm. And so we are rebellious in that we are not following the rules. And, you know, our parents are the image. They are the standard that is mm. set for that church, for that faith, for whatever it is that they believe. And the moment you do anything outside of that, you're being rebellious. Mm. But rebellious in, you know, in definition to what they believe. But to us, it's actually research. <laughs> I'm mm. trying to find out who am I? Mm. Who, what's my identity? What do I like? What do I believe? How do I want to dress? How do I want to talk? Because, mm. uh, you know, in our church, it was so strict. I never had earrings when my dad was still alive. I actually got them after he passed away. I was not allowed to wear pants. Um, the whole thing, you know, I got married, got divorced, had a child out of wedlock, all of that. Judgment, 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 judgment. And now it alienates this Christ or God himself and whatever it is that he actually represents. Mm. And so you don't really know who God is. Yazi and Jobu Kulumaganje or Kulumangama life experiences that are part of each journey your moon to end when you Abigail? I think two things. Firstly, um, church is church, it's fellowship. But there's a Christ, there's a God that you need to have a personal relationship mm. with. And once you find him for yourself, everything else begins to make sense. Secondly, I'm an ordained prophetess. But I don't believe that I am who I am. And I don't believe that my destiny is the way it is because of where I was born. I believe that God placed me in that family because of my destiny. They are the perfect people to equip me, perfect people to shape me, mold me, build within me the characteristics I have today. And so we need to understand that it's not the other way around. It's not I'm a preacher's kid and therefore I'll be a pastor, no. But because I'm a pastor, because I have a calling, I have an anointing, I have power and authority and dominion, there's certain people that need to guide that so that it's not misused or misinterpreted.